right now i have used so many times force and all how do you exactly define a force because your statics is completely based on your statics is completely based on force and their effects so how exactly we define a force you know force is an external agent which tends to change the state of a body now what is exactly state of body if the body is at rest you apply force you can bring that in a motion or if the body is in motion you apply force in opposite direction you can bring that body at rest so that means what it can change the state of a body right so it is an external agent and what are the units si unit generally we use either newton if the magnitude is very large then we use kilo newton and all so these are the units we use in engineering mechanics now what are the characteristics of a force or how do you designate the force so in order to designate force you should have magnitude direction point of application the last one is nature so these are characteristics of force now what exactly is magnitude now take this example here the block is resting on horizontal plane suppose i apply a force of say 10 newton in order to move it i am applying 10 newton so this 10 newton is called as magnitude it can be newton kilo newton or whatever it is it is the quantity of force that is applied on a block next direction now what is the direction the line of action you can see here there is a line of action along which the force acts that is called as direction next point of application that is the point where the force is acting if i take this point as e then the point of application for this problem is point a then finally the fourth one is nature nature means whether it is pulling the body or pushing pull or push or whether the force applied is tension or compression now if you take this example here it is actually pulling the body right same way if you apply force or the direction is towards the body then it is pushing so that comes under nature next what are the effects of forces that means what will happen on a body when force acts so you know very first thing is it can accelerate the body or particle that means the body starts moving second it can retard second one is it can retard the body next it can deform the body you know what exactly is deformation so after application of force what happens there is going to be change in size and shape that is called as deformation so these are the effects of forces some of the important effects of forces